Stick around for the show. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, that was Tobacco Road. Put your hands together one more time for the music and the magic of Tobacco Road. Now remember, this band does not play for free. So if you haven't finished your sandwich or your yogurt, please step right up, talk to the drummer. familiar to you for my three different runs for mayor. In 1992, I received 6,611 votes, and only one of them was mine. Well, I said it better not pause for applause here, Lou. I'm a university writing professor and a professional magician and a San Diego native, and I know more about running my hometown than our arrogant lame duck mayor from Muskogee. I guess she's not listening. I'd be honored to have your votes because I want to save my hometown. I want to roll back the evil Republicans' record of greed by the sea and decay by the bay. As a Democrat, I feel we should work together to explore the stars, while the, the Republicans' philosophy is always cover your anus. I want to defend affirmative action against bigoted losers like Pete Wilson and Buchanan. As a Great Panther member, I will pursue their slate of affordable housing and health care. I'd like to help my hometown create community daycare centers, shelter abused women and children, and resurrect the homeless to productivity. I think we can find them somewhere to go and something to do. Well, they're just like police, right? You can't find them when you want them. One of my new ideas is to create an urban chain gang which could provide labor for civic projects. Yes, indeed, he said chain gang. I'd pay for this by levying fair taxes on church property. I think it is improper that every church and cult in the United States gets exempted from property tax, no matter how flaky, no matter how little they pay for their divinity degree in the back of the Rolling Stone magazine, they get free property tax, and it's illegal, and it's wrong. I'd also institute a fraud and waste 800 hotline for a little le local legislative life of section. Hope I'm not talking too fast for you to write. Another overlooked source of funding would be for the air and water quality boards to begin to fine toxic polluters. They should clean up their messes just like dog owners do in OB, right? Can I get a yeah? Yeah. All right. Thanks for waking up, folks. I know it's early. I believe only a strong, charismatic Democrat can rally voters and defend the environment. The evil Republican Party ignores seniors, oppresses minorities, starves children, endangers the environment, reduces social services, shuns gays, devalues women, and then jealously shuts down the government. And for this, they deserve extinction, right? Yeah. Yeah. This ain't right. It makes that show go faster. <laughs> I will expose and destroy the evil Republicans, starting with greedy Susan Golding. I will not allow her to leapfrog towards Sacramento by abusing San Diego. You hear me, Susan? Just shake the building if you do. I will not allow her to leapfrog towards Sacramento by abusing San Diego. With such a good night, I repeated it. We deserve a clean environment, not a permit to pollute the bay. With your votes, I will dispel the stench of political greed with the sweet sea breeze. Please remember to vote March 26th for Locke David Crane as mayor of San Diego. I want to thank you very much. That's my hot perspective. All right. Oh, you see, that's what happens when you spend six million dollars for a stadium without voter approval. Uh oh. <laughs> I'm doing, I'm gonna do a magic trick. You wanna see a magic trick? Step in a little closer, I need audience. Come on, come on. 